Good morning. Welcome back to the channel, Resourceful Living. We are at the Connex, and today, since our tornado, the wife has bought a solar kit. And let me show you this. This is a complete kit. Now, like in previous videos you have seen i've already pre-wired this for 12 volt system but may not always be able to charge that so we are going to do a solar panel i'm going to make it as compact as i can and follow Here's my plan for making a compact solar system that you can just unplug and take with you if you need to, or leave it here. I'm gonna take this ammo box, cut this out. We're gonna install this on the outside. So I have switches for different areas that I wanna, if I got different things to hook up, which positive, negative, I'll put these posts on it. And that way you can run six different things. It also will have this little deep cycle battery that'll be inside this box. And the solar will charge it. It'll be compact, easy to take. All right, so what I did is I made me a template this same size as the inside of this. So I made this template to make it easy to draw around it so I can cut this square out and we'll install our switch panel. All right, we have the hole cut out for our switch panel. That's gonna go inside there. I'll clean up that sticker and everything. But right now we are cutting the leads that are gonna come off each one of these switches that are gonna feed these individual posts that I'm gonna put on it. And you'll see how that comes. Okay, I have the switchboard mounted. And I'll run each one of these leads to a post out here on the outside. These switches will control whichever post they go to. They all come hot when they're turned on. I also have 12 volt plug-in, USB and Type-C charger. Battery showing 13.2. She is charged. But then, when you hook this controller up, To the solar panel, it will keep this battery charged. So I have made a portable compact 12 volt generator basically. It can run lights inside the Connex, it can charge phones, and this is exactly what we need in case we have a disaster. Again, we've got solar panel that will keep a battery charged. Well, there you have it. Power by demand. If you need something 12 volt to charge or run lights. However many of these you hook up, you can power them by the switches. 
right now I've just got two. So I've got, I'm going to power this one here and this one here. And if I see that we need more to add, I'll add more of these terminals, stack them. But that's it. Battery showing 13.2. All you got to do is hook up your controller to the solar panel and it'll charge that battery. My portable solar panel doesn't have to be a permanent mount. You can permanent mount it and unplug it and unhook it if you need to but this is my little creation i made and let me show you how it works so this is solar panel lead here is the controller it already shows battery is low but it does have power output so let's hook up the solar panel. Okay. Solar panel is hooked up. Charging. And here's how this thing works. So if you got a full charge battery, you don't have to leave it hooked up to the panel all the time, but it is a backup to this battery that runs our 12 volt system in here. But depending on how long the outage is, and you have to depend on solar, all I have to do is unhook here behind the switch. Hook up these leads to this one. This switch powers these. And you can power your lights off the back of this switch if that battery there does. Or whatever you need to charge or power up because my little box has the capability of giving you a 12 volt plug and USB. And right now she is charging the battery. I'm just going to let it set and charge. Well, that is my portable solar panel kit that can be taken anywhere. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please subscribe. We got a lot more cool things that my little brain likes to dream of and put together. And, uh, Subscribe, hit that notification bell, and anytime we got something new, whether it's myself or my wife, you'll be on top of it. Well, until next time.